Hey Tiger, are you ready for our lesson today? We'll be doing percentage and fractions. That sounds challenging. It is, but very interesting too. You will love it. So, shall we begin? You bet. Bring it on. Percentage and fractions. Introduction 1. What is percentage? When we say percent, we are really saying per 100. Percentage tells us how much out of 100. Percent is the symbol for percentage. Let's see an example. This is a square divided into 100 equal smaller squares. Let's shade 50 out of 100 smaller squares in blue. This means 50% of the square is blue. Now let's shade 25 out of 100 smaller squares in green. This means 25% of the square is green. Now let's shade 5 out of 100 smaller squares in pink. This means 5% of the square is pink. Now let's shade 100 out of 100 smaller squares in purple. This means 100% of the square is purple. Percentage is a fraction that always has 100 in the denominator and is written as numerator with percent sign. Percentage to fraction Let's convert percentage to fraction. Express 16% as a fraction. Percentage says how much out of 100, so the denominator of the fraction should always be 100. 16% means 16 out of 100. We can write it as 16 by 100. Let's simplify. 4 divides 16 4 times. And 4 divides 100 25 times. So 16% equals 4 by 25. Express 8% as a fraction. 8% means 8 out of 100. We can write it as 8 by 100. Let's simplify. 4 divides 8 2 times and 4 divides 100 25 times. So 8% equals 2 by 25. So buddy, did you get it? Percentage means how much out of a hundred. So the denominator should always be hundred. You got that right. <laughs>